running with my favorite toys. Baby shark, da 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 da. Baby shark, da 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 da. Baby shark, da 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 da. Baby shark. Mommy shark did it, did it, did it, did Mommy shark did it, did it, did it, did Mommy shark did it, did it, did it, did Mommy shark. Daddy shark did it, did it, did it, Daddy shark did it, did it, did it, Daddy shark did it, did it, did it, Daddy shark. Grandma shark did it, did it, did it, Grandma shark did it, did it, did it, Grandma shark did it, did it, did it, Grandma shark. Grandpa shark da 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 da. Grandpa shark da 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 da. Grandpa shark da 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 da. Grandpa shark. Hi everyone. Today we are gonna go fishing. How excited! And while we're fishing, we're gonna practice our numbers and counting. Who is gonna count with me? Let's get started. We have this beautiful teddy bear which will serve as our fishing pond today. And where are the fish? Let's see, what color is this? A blue fish. Number two is a green fish. Number three is orange. Number four is yellow. Ooh, he's jumping. Number five is pink. Number six is a light pink. Number seven is purple. Number eight is red. Number nine is brown. And number 10, let's call this orange red. So we have 10 fish. Who wants to go fishing first? <gasps> we have two of these fishing rods. And we see our shark family on the right. We see grandma shark, baby shark, daddy shark, grandpa shark, and mommy shark. Grandma shark is going to start. Wish me luck. I am going to go for, yay, the orange fish. Let's get it out of there. Yummy. Baby shark, you are next. Let's see, which fish is baby shark going to go for? What color? Green. Mm, let's pull out the green fish. Pull, pull, yay, there it is. One green fish for baby shark, there you go. Next up is daddy shark. What color fish is he gonna catch? Mm, all of them look yummy. <laughs> Let's go hunt it. Da, 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 da. Let's go hunt it. Da, 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 da. Oh, he's aiming for the blue one. Pull, pull. There we go. One blue fish for Daddy Shark. Thank you. And Mommy Shark wants to go next. Which fish is she going to catch? What colors do we see? <gasps> The brown fish took a bite. Yum, 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 yum. Grandpa Shark, which color are you looking for? Well, the green fish is already gone, right? Baby Shark caught that one. So let's see what colors are left. We have five sharks and ten fish. That means each shark can catch two fish. <gasps> The purple one for Grandpa Shark. Uh oh, it got loose. Oh no. Grandpa Shark, do you want to try again? Hmm, which fish is going to bite? Oh, the light pink one. Yay, finally a fish for Grandpa Shark. He's so hungry. <coughs> Baby Shark, your turn again. Let's see. Which fish is going to bite? Yellow for baby shark. That's a nice catch. Yay. Oh, grandpa shark gets the yellow one. That's fine. So green with yellow for both of them. And he's aiming for the pink one. <gasps> and he got it. Yay. Who's going to get the pink? Grandpa shark, 
Ooh, he's gonna get a lot of fish. He had to wait the longest. Maybe he's super hungry. One, two, three, fish for Grandpa Shark. Okay, let's go again. We have three more fish in the pond. Yay, here's our orange red fish. Another fish for Grandpa Shark. Now he has three. Three plus one is four. Okay, two fish left in the pond. Which one are we gonna catch next? Ooh, 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 ooh. We have purple and red. Which is it gonna be? Purple! Who gets the purple fish? Grandpa Shark? He must be so hungry. Now he has one, two, three, four, five fish. That means we're missing the red one and now the pond is empty. Grandpa Shark has six fish now. Way! That is one big meal for Grandpa Shark. Let's remove the pond. Who wants to do some math with me? We have one, two, three, four, five, six fish for Grandpa. And the rest of our family has one each. One for each shark. That means 10 in total. Six plus four is 10. Let's use our numbers. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Where's number nine? Here the nine looks like an upside down six, right? Where's our fish number 10? Someone has been helping all the fish escape while we were talking about our numbers. Uh-oh, where did they go? What do you think? Let's see, maybe they jumped back into the pond. <gasps> there they are, some brave little fish. Escape back into the pond. Good job, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One and zero. This is a ten. So, what happens if we remove one of the fishies? Boop. Ten minus one is nine. Save another one from the shark. So now we have two fishies here. That means we have how many left in the pond? Eight. Ten minus two is eight. Now we have three fishies. One, two, three. Over here. That means one, two, three, four, five, six, seven back in the pond. Ten minus three is seven. Let's get this one out, the light pink one. How many do we have? One, two, three, four. Ten minus four is one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we have five fishies in freedom. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Four plus one is five. There we go. One, two, three, four, five left in a pond. <clears throat> five plus one is how many fishies? One, two, three, four, five, six. Now we have six fishies and one, two, three, four left in the pond. Ten minus six is four. Six plus one is five plus one, two, seven. And one, two, three left in the pond. Ten minus seven is three. Now we have how many left in freedom? We had five in a row. 
Someone is making a mess with this train. Okay, we have five over here, plus one, two, three. That is eight fishies we saved from the sharks. 10 minus eight is one, two. So we have two left in the pond. Let's get another one out. So eight plus one is one, two, three, four, five plus four is nine. And we have one left in the pond. What does the number one look like? There we go. And then if we take the last fish out of the pond, boop, we have zero fish back in the pond, right? And that means we have five plus one, two, three, four, five. We have all 10 fishies over here. Yay, and zero in the pond. Now for those of you who say that is too easy, let's do some math with Baby Shark. So we have two different signs, a plus sign and a minus sign. Let's do some additions first. Let's practice our sums. We have one fish over here plus a yellow one. equals one plus one is two. Let's add another fish. So we have one, two over here, plus two plus one equals one, two, three in total. Let's get more fish. If we have two plus two, that equals one, two, three, four. Yay. So now we have one, two, three fish plus one, two fish. That means in total we have one, two, three, four, five fish. Now we have one, two, three plus one, two, three, the same amount. That equals one, two, three, four, five, six fish. Math has never been that easy, right? So what do we have over there? We have four fish. And here we still have the three fish. That equals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now we have four fish on each side. The same amount. Four plus four is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's add another one. So four plus one, what comes after four? Five. And on this side, we still have four. Five plus four equals five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very good. And we have one more fish. So we have five on each side. If we add one fish to the four fish, five plus five equals one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All of our ten fishies. Yay! You are great at doing sums, guys. What do you say? Let's do some subtractions. Let's use our minus sign. Whoop. Zip. So we have still five on this side and we have five on that side. So every same amount of fish on each side, meaning all of the fish would swim away. Then we have zero fish, right? Five minus five is zero. So let's take one away on the right side. So we have five on the left side, minus one, two, three, four. So what does that mean? We have four, five fish and we take four of them away. That equals how many fish? Let's ask the shark family for help because we have five sharks, right? So 
We have five sharks and we take one, two, three away. How many sharks are left? <gasps> Just grandpa shark. It's one shark. Yay. So what happens if more of the fish go away? Now we have five on the left side. Oh, they both went into the pond. And we have three on the right side. Five minus three is how many? So remember the shark family are five sharks. We take two of them, three of them away. That leaves one, two. And now another fish is gonna escape. So we have three fish in the pond. That means five minus one, two is how many sharks? We have the shark family and two go for lunch. That means we have one, two, three left. There we go. Now another one is gonna escape. We have four fish in the pond. We have five minus one is how many? Just one of the shark family is gonna swim away. That means we have one, two, three, four sharks left. Ta-da! Now the last fish is gonna swim away. Bloop! So we have five fish in the pond. That means we have zero left here. Five minus zero is five because nobody's gonna go away. All of the shark family is still there. So let's see if the rest of our fish are gonna escape to the pond as well. We have one, two, three, four, five fish in the pond. Hopefully the shark family will not eat the rest of them. Oh no! Looks like the red one escaped. So now we have six in the pond, seven in the pond, eight in the pond, nine in the pond, and 10 in the pond. So all of the 10 fish escaped. Hooray! Thank you for practicing colors and numbers with me. Doing math is super fun. I hope to see you soon. For the two more.